Well, let me show you the history of a $25,000 grant <laughs> that you can get for fixing up your house if you're an investor or if you're a homeowner. Well, I guess investors are homeowners too, but you're not living there. See, a lot of the grant fix-up money is not only is only for people that live there. And actually, this one also, like other grant fix-up money, uh, has income requirements, but the income requirements go up to $90,000. You know, <laughs> and so that's sort of interesting. <laughs> and also, you don't even have to be current on your taxes, you know, uh, you know your property taxes, as long as you're in a payment system or something like that. So there's all kinds of things. And if you have disabilities, that's even a special category. So all this money, now see, it starts with like $50 million from the treasury in Washington. Now this is uh, where an organization in Michigan gets it. This organization is called Michigan Housing Opportunity. <laughs> and they get it from, they got $50 million from, uh, from the treasury department. And like 15 million of that went to Detroit for them to spend it. And 50 million, I mean, uh, yeah, 50 million uh, went to the rest of the people. Oh no, I think it was 35, tell you the truth. Uh, <laughs> What's well, a few million, <laughs> a few zeros in government work, yeah. Uh, but anyway, what you have to do if you're not in Detroit to some of that problem is find out who has that money. Now, how it spreads out to the rest of it, there's another organization, uh, this organization, gives it to other nonprofits. So nonprofits have to apply to this organization to be able to give individual, you know, $25,000 grants uh, to homeowners or investors or whatever. Now I tell you this, you may not live in Detroit, right? That doesn't matter. What I'm telling you, you have to realize what the system is like to look for. Because you just, can't, I'm gonna go to HUD and find a program. No. <laughs> You, know, you have no idea where it is. You, you can't work that way. And I'll show you how, no matter where you live, to start tracking this kind of grant money down. And that's why what we do at Let's Go Help is we show you. We give you, okay, here's all the best possible places where you live in your city that most likely have all this. So it'd be this, like the Michigan Housing Opportunity Program. See, that would be there. And see what happens is you have to then go to the Michigan Opportunity Program <laughs> and get a listing of organizations that gave, they gave the money to. See? So here it is. I think there's like uh, what, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, seven, seventeen. Seventeen organizations throughout the state. Now you can get that list at this <laughs> other website that I that has the major money that gives it to these. See what happens? These nonprofit organizations apply to them to get grant money, and, and then they give it to individuals where they live, and they take a little percentage of it. You know. Uh, as uh, this is how they stay in business to do that. Okay, the other thing what's interesting is about, here's a copy of the application. Everybody's, oh, oh I got a $20,000 grant application. Oh, I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna never be able to do this. Oh, I need help. I better get an extra $1,000 to pay somebody. No, 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 don't think like that. So here's an application for a $25,000 grant. Okay, here it is. Okay, what it has is names of all the people in the household. Now that's tough, isn't it? You're gonna to have to get a team of experts to figure that out. <laughs> you go look in the bedrooms. Okay, and then what? How long you lived there? Number of dependents, you know, uh, your employer. Okay, this is it. Now the hard one starts. The data on the property, you know, uh, the original mortgage land contract amount. So there's a couple fill in the blanks there. And then there's how you spend some of your money. You put in whatever you want there. And then the address, bim, bam, thank you, man, sign, cosign, and you're done. Wow. Now you think you had to hire somebody to do that? You probably have to find out some of these numbers, but they're gonna have to find out <laughs> too who you, who you pay to fill it out. And you're, they don't know where this stuff is. You, they have to find, you have to find it for them. So why pay them to fill in those three numbers? You know, that's what I, I'm trying to get to realize that you have that power not to be trapped. Okay, and here it is. Uh, uh, that's the poverty level is there. I think I have oh, Michigan Opportunities Promoting Energy Efficient Program. I see that's the organization that got the money 
that gives it out to nonprofits, that gives it to individuals, you know, and they get $25 to fix up their home, okay? And they want to do it is, uh, it's for be more energy efficient, to be health, you know, um, a healthier home, and to be safer. And particularly if you have a disability, to, to make accommodations for your disability. So there's five grand. Okay, how are you gonna find it? Okay, you go to one of my favorite places, 211.org or find, uh, F-I-N-D, you have to know how to know how to spell find, then H-E-L-P, and then you put the little org on the end of it, and then you put in your zip code, here's my N20009, you put in there, uh, and then you, Okay, then up here where you put a keyword, okay, you put home repair. P. How do you spell repair? R E P A I R. Oh, report? No. Ah, I'll get it. I'll live long enough. Well, I have lived long enough. You think I'd have it by now, huh? Okay, 216 programs. These are 216 nonprofit organizations like the, those I showed you. That's where they get the money from, from the state. The state got it from <coughs> the Treasury Department, and now they're giving it to you here and find help. Find that in Google, I tell you. If you know their name, you may, but you wouldn't know any of their names, right? And that's why. Well, this is what we do at Let's Go Help, trying to teach people what the system is. You want to get this stuff? It's not where you think. It's not in Google, put in home repair. <laughs> You go put in home repair instead, and then put it in find help. See what you get. Home repair, you want me to do that? Uh, I think we're running out of time, but what the hell, huh? <laughs> home repair. Okay, so we got 217. You wanna know how many we here have here? Uh, yeah, let's see, four billion. <laughs> Four billion, B -b 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 -bill. I thought it was million, no, it's a billion. So you want four billion websites in, in Google, or do you want to go here that has 216? Sure, that's a pain in the ass too, right? <laughs> but that's where it is. <laughs> You'll never come out alive if you start tackling that four billion. That's what we do at Let's Go Help. Let us help you too, letsgohelp.com. Man, I just want to help as many people as I can before I die. So help me, help me, help me, <laughs> help me, Wanda.